How's it going everyone? My name is Mike and welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode. Still in episode 2, assembly required. We now have Magnus and we escaped when like Boomtown got destroyed by the monster. So let's, uh, I think we're going to go find that other person now, the one on the right hand side there. I, don't, I can't remember their name. So let's uh, press A and find out. Alright, we are back at the base, it looks like. A kid. Go get that other guy now. Okay, just a little farther. Wow! Someone really went bonkers with the defenses, huh? <laughs> oh, who goes there? Oh, Jesse? Is that you? Wow, it's a, did you build, yeah. <laughs> Lucas, did you build all of this? Well, yeah. I, I figured I would try and fortify the place, you know? Nice! I'm so glad you're back. And we brought Magnus! Fantastic! Quick, come on. You guys are never going to believe who showed up while you were gone. Oh, Gabriel. Gabriel. Hello, everyone. It's good to see you. He showed up not too long before you guys. Magnus, my old you friend. You always were a tough cookie to keep down. <laughs> it's good to see you. It's good to see you too, you old meathead. Oh, and it's especially good to see you, Jesse. I fear that you might be the last face I ever saw. Yeah, I wonder how you got out of that. Getting here was hard. I don't understand. How did you escape? If you hadn't pulled me out of the Witherstorm's clutches, well, let's just not think about that. I came here to the temple, hoping against hope to find other survivors. It makes me glad that even in these terrible oh, times, oh, yeah. this Petra? temple can I didn't stand pick as a stronghold, a symbol. Wow, did Petra get away too? Did you see? Oh, that creature left in its wake was bedrock. Those people, your friend Petra, no one could get away. I think she's still alive. We are alive. That means there's still hope. Come along. Everyone else is still inside. Wow, it's been a while since I've been here. What is she doing here? Oh, this isn't going to go well. Right, um, I forgot to mention, Olivia went on a little expedition of her own while you were gone. And this Olivia person came back with her? Did you know about this? Did Eligard put you up to this? You think you Isn't know a guy, the and then, I don't... bam! Everyone just coming and going around. I don't know who that is. This is a problem? <laughs> you bet your butt it's a problem. No way am I working with her. Not after... Oh, was... <sighs> so the other person that they went and Jesse, grabbed. Jesse, Jesse, look, I found Eligard. Must be, yep. Hang on okay. a sec, okay? I'll go figure out what's going on. Good. Oh, we don't get to see that part of the story then. Easy now, Olivia. Let's try and play it cool. Hmm? So, who are you now? And why did you bring him with you? Magnus is awesome. Oh, yeah, let's go for... We are reuniting the Order of the Stone. That one. It was kind of crazy, actually. I went to Redstonia, and there were all these incredible engineers and inventors. It was a little intimidating, actually. But Eligard's made me her protege. Well, assistant for now. I mean... After what happened. I know, I'm sorry. So sorry. <laughs> I want to say A so bad. I'm the king of Boontown. <laughs> Very impressive. She might have, well, embarrassed herself. A tiny bit. Yeah. But after I pled my case, she agreed to take me on as her assistant and come back to help. Not bad, right? Oh, hooray! It's Ellie. And here I was just starting to enjoy myself. Hello, Magnus. Your voice is exactly as pleasant as I remember. 
Which is to say, not at all. Oh, my feelings. Is that the same wit you're gonna use to save the world? Why? You're here to tell me how to do it better? Oh, I would never dream of doing that. Unlike you, I actually do things instead of just talking about them. Hey, that's Eligard you're talking to. Show her some respect. Wow, you finally found yourself a live one. Hey, your little devotees oh, are usually a little more stop, on the bookish side. Would you all cut it out? Holy crap, you're all acting like crazy people. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry Witherstorm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. Yeah, I'll admit, that thing looked real nasty. And I've seen some nasty stuff in my time. Too much for you, was it? Your usual brutish approach didn't cut it? Hey, you weren't there, all right? You didn't see how this thing just tore oh. everything up. Children. You've never seen anything like it. Would you two stop fighting? Whoa! Yikes. Jesse speaks the truth. We must find a way to defeat that monstrosity. Wasn't there one more person we had to get? I don't know if you've looked around yet, but this place isn't nearly the stronghold it used to be. Most of our supplies are gone. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. Let's. I. Uh, I thought along? you. Let's go with so that. So what one. are we gonna do? How are we gonna stop it? Well, let's not panic. First of all, that's a good first step. But even if we had all the TNT for miles around, I don't know if it would be enough. If only Soren were here. He might have something we could use. Oh, oh, that's the other person. Not this again. Wait, Magnus. She may have a point. Soren did have certain objects, inventions. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. Let's, I think I got a legitimate idea do... here. Something stronger than TNT. Something stronger than TNT? Soren had a kind of super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. A formidable. Yeah, yeah, bomb. yeah. I've heard all about the F bomb before. F bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F bomb could destroy anything. Do you know where it is? Can we get some? Well, there's a little problem there. We don't know where Soren is, but you found Magnus and Eligard. Do you know where he is? Yeah, I just realized that. Gabriel's voice sounds very much like the the dude from Walking Dead series. Oh, I've forgotten his name. Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the nether or the end. But it's worth a shot. He wasn't on the map. I bet we can find him. I can't remember if he was or wasn't on the map when we searched. I remember there was two of them. Yeah, but his voice sounds exactly like Lee. Lee, that's the character's name. I swear, it must be the same person. I had to look that up. Um, okay, so we need to go, we need to find, let's use the pedestal. Don't need to talk to people. They're all gonna say, talk what we've just discussed. Oh, don't tell me I've got to go fiddle around with that again. Who's been touching it? Lucas, you've been touching the little switches. Hmm. Thought we had a conversation about this. Wait, what's, what are these here? Nothing. Alright, I can only do... Okay. Oh, I had to turn one on. Yeah, see, there we go. We're missing silver, is that? Alright, there's your light. My light. Ah, that's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order broke up, that's where he went to keep doing his experiments. Look, he invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. Glad we can agree on that at any rate. I mean, uh, I never actually went. I didn't know which one. That one or B would have been the same. Us, right? Whoa. It didn't do that before. What the hell? Are you sure it's blue? Blue? 
Lou? That's Ivor. Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move. Oh dear. I was going to say, I knew about Ivor, but... Not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Perfect. We can wait till tomorrow morning and travel with a full day's sunlight. Uh, and risk that thing catching up with us? I think I've had enough wither storm for one day. Uh, thank you very much. Great, right, because getting caught out there in the dark is so much better. Trust me. If you had seen this thing, you wouldn't want to um, Trust I think me. we'll leave in the morning, because, yeah, night time, more things are going to come out. Of being caught out in the dark with all the monsters. Yeah. Eligard's got a point. I don't want to risk being outside when it gets dark. We should wait till morning so we can have a full day of sunlight. Magnus is going to remember that. Call, Jesse. I bet it's going to pop up. more decisive than either of us. What a coincidence that it's your... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Knew it. Uh, yo. I'm not going out in the dark, man. It's too risque. Okay, everyone, rest up. We'll head out at first light, all right? No one's listening to you. <laughs> Jesse, right? Oh, hello. I'm sorry if I seemed a little hostile before when we were talking about Magnus. Not the best way to get acquainted. He makes me a little crazy. He's just a little nuts, destructive, egotistical. He definitely self-centered. I could go on, but nah, I try not to. Do that one. I gotta ask, what's up with you guys? Why do you fight so much? Magnus and I have had some <coughs> tough situations together and haven't always agreed on how to get out of them. After a while, it just starts to become too much. In any case, thank you for taking my side before. I appreciate that. So, how is it being the leader of this little ragtag bunch? I haven't been observing your group long, but it seems a little dysfunctional. It's been really hard when people get fighting, when tough decisions have to be made. Precisely why I never wanted to be the leader. It was just sort of easier to be alone. In any case, glad to be part of the team. How about we go get some sleep? I thought she was going to hug me for a minute. I was like, alright love, calm down. sleep to do the body right. I am ready to do some blasting today. Well, I'm glad you're in such high spirits, friend. I'm still feeling a touch under the weather myself. And here it comes. Uh, guys? Ah, crap! I told you it was going to catch up with us. Oh, you really weren't kidding. Yeah, but I'm not. Oh, you know what? Whatever. We can hash all that out later because we got some monsters to fight here, people. Okay, I don't think it would have mattered. This is what I tried to avoid, and then suddenly. How does Magnus fight? How does Elgard? That's why it's what we're. Go. Shoot him. What are you doing? I'm out, I'm out, I'm out of arrows, okay. Come on. Whoa, 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 where, where, where? Da, da, da. Oh, that was annoying, I'm out of arrows, so I was just like, Ew. Oh, he had an arrow in him. But, ah! There we go, got him. Let's get out of here. Tired of this wither storm. Agreed. This creature never stop. Soren's isn't much farther. We can make it. Soren's place has got to be just ahead. Come on. Yeah, but surely, um, Ivor was already like halfway there when we looked at night before we went to bed. So surely Ivor's already there. from 
anyone. Enchanting, isn't it? <coughs> He's not very well, is he? Yeah, and I'm really not feeling those columns. Ah, oh, come on! It's fine! Look! Woo! <laughs> Ruben doesn't like that idea. Don't fall, okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is deep. That is very, very deep. Ruben! No! Hang on, I'm coming! Damn it, pig! There we go. Let's go, get up. Yep, just run and jump and leave him Jesse, again. You okay? That was crazy. I'm more curious why the ground kept moving. So weird. Whoa. What are they? Look! What is that? Enderman. Okay. So many. What are they doing? Glad we're yeah. doing down there. I'm not sure, but I'm glad we're not a part of it. Come on, we should get out of here. Olivia and the others already went ahead. Wow, this architecture—it's incredible. That's pretty cool. Looks like the others already swam across. Guess we better catch up. Wait, there's something, see that octopus type thing? Squid. Oh, be quiet! It's just a pointless building! That's all she I'm swims saying. so I weird. Lucas, like, eh, eh. I'm going. Once again, it falls to me to take care of everything. I'll find this super TNT myself. Oh, no, no, no. You do not get to be the one who walks away. That's it! I'm going! See? I'm walking away too now! Super TNT! Here I come! It's hard to pick glass half full when they keep kicking the glass over. And I thought they were doing so well. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. Bickering is kind of their deal. But hopefully they'll work things out and get on with the important stuff. What are we gonna do now? Where should we go? Let's figure it out. Green or red, or yeah, that's uh, that's kind of where we gotta go. Green or red, I think. Oh, I had a really good view. Now I gotta really shoot. Let's go red. I've had enough of Magnus already. He's just, I don't know. They're both, both annoying. Follow her. Yeah. Gabriel, are you okay? I know it's not the best time, and I, I don't want to worry you, but there's something I'd like to discuss with you in private, Jesse. But let's split up. Whoa. I'm aware that letting them head off alone was risky, but I need to talk to you about a private matter. It's not the easiest thing to bring up. Hey, whatever it is, I trust you. You can tell me. I'm Thank dying. You for being so understanding. I'm so glad to see my old friends together again. I don't want to ruin it with this. What? You may have succeeded in getting me away from the Witherstorm, but I fear it was already too late. Knew it. <laughs> noticed it not long after you saved me. What is that? What's wrong with your arm? Tell me. Do you know what Wither is? The Wither? Of course. We've been... No. Just Wither. Or Wither Sickness, to be more descriptive. It is something I've contracted before in my travels. But it always wears off. It seems that Ivor's monster exudes a Wither Sickness that is decidedly more... fatal. Well, we're gonna go back and tell the others we can get help. No, Jesse. 
You can't tell anyone about this. Ah. Creeper, look out! Take my hand. I'll pull you up. Take my hand. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Your strong hand or arm, whatever it was. My compromised. I couldn't maintain my hold. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Maybe if you used your right arm. Are you all right? Uh. Hey, you're the one that's sick. Take care of yourself <laughs> first. I'll be okay. Time to be a hero again. Stay safe. I'll find a way down to you. <laughs> Well, wow. that was entertaining. All right, well, let's um, let's go grab that, shall we? We're gonna come across some of those. What are they called? Enders? Can I just go along? No, thought I could just go along that bit. Why am I holding this out? Is it supposed to be a light or something? What's the point of having the item bar thing? Ooh, what's that? Nope. Oh, it is a light. It's a bit blue. It's a really shitty light. Gotta look out for the gaps in the ground. If you just walked onto this bit here, you wouldn't have to do all of this. But it's too easy then, isn't it? Alright, what's out there? Come on. Oh, this is the middle bit again, the amulet. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I see an open door or something like that. Let's go up there. Yourself. Who's there? Sival. <gasps> you. Trying to interfere with my plans again, I see. Your tenacity is commendable, yet misguided. Uh, you here? Why are so you... So now you may find it back out again. I found the rest of the Order. What good will that do? I'm here with the Order to find Soren's Super TNT. We're gonna take down your Witherstorm. The Order? <laughs> Believe me. Blow up in their faces in more ways than one. They cannot help you. But me? I choose not to. Out of my way. But, uh. Move. No. Sorry, Ivor. I'm. Stop oh. right there, Ivor! <laughs> Gabriel! You're alive! Against all your best efforts, Ivor. Look at what you've done. I never dreamt that even you could be this twisted. Save your posturing, Gabriel. We both know your words have always been hollow, just like the border. They're not going anywhere anymore. At least not in one piece. We can't piece. leave. The oh, what should we go for? Me, but this sword will pass through you. I'm not letting him leave either. Yeah, I'm coming at you really slow. The only one who can stop the wither storm. Not you, not the order. Don't make yourselves the villains in my story. Yeah. What? Come on, I counted that. Stay and fight you, Now stab him. This could have all been avoided. If you want to stop me, you'll have to catch me first. I was going to say, I bet he was going to throw one of those smoke... 
Oh. We mustn't let him escape. I said I bet he's going to throw a smoke bomb at this flash. I'm like the wind. He's the Flash. And I'm the Matrix. Or Neo. No! Oh. I'll cut through you if I have to. Yeah, I'm coming. Don't tempt your face. Oh, someone knock him out already. It didn't have to go this way, Jesse. You could have just let me go. <laughs> now you see me. Now you. That, there's the kind of the smoke grenade. He's done this before. Be careful. Don't let him leave. He could be anywhere. Stay on your guard. Invisible or not, he isn't going to get by me. I bet you he will, but. Just stand down. This one's on you, you puffed up fool. Oh, nice. I don't know how you managed that. Uh, there's no time for this. Jesse, Gabriel, even more of you? Will this parade of useless babblers never cease? What's going on? Found Ivor. Stopped him. Hm. False. You have stopped nothing. Query, have you ever seen the effects of a splash potion of slowness? Hmm. <laughs> so why is he got so many potions? It's so unfair. That they can destroy the wither storm, but they are mistaken, and it will cost them their lives. Next time on Minecraft Story Mode. In pursuit of answers, all our heroes found in Sauron's armory was deceit and treachery. Locked in a dark chamber deep in Sauron's mountain, as the Order of the Stone rides off towards near certain doom, our heroes must ask themselves, would they find a way out of this dark tomb? Is there any way to cure Gabriel's wither sickness? Would they find a way to defeat the wither storm? Or will they remain trapped as it continues its ravenous rampage across the entire world? Only time will tell. Well, there we go, everyone. That is episode two completed. That was quite a short episode, actually. You managed to do that in two parts, quite reasonable. And uh, yeah, well, we tried to stop Ivor there, but that didn't happen. Still trying to look for that um, bomb that's going to kill the Withering. Trying to find, I swear there was another person of the Order. So try and find them. They might pop along somewhere. But other than that, if you like this episode, remember to hit the like and subscribe button. And I'll see you again soon for episode three, the last place you look. Peace.